Hi everyone, today I'm going to be doing a haul and I'm going to be showing you some clothes from Hollister and New Look and some other little bits. Also, I changed my background because I really don't like putting up my lights sometimes. It's just, it makes my room really messy. It takes ages to set up. So what I've done is I'm kind of just using natural light from the window and I really enjoy doing that. So this is my background for today. Also, I have a little V like here. It's like a light up V. You can't really see it. I <laughs> appreciate my effort making this background look semi okay. <laughs> right, so let's get started. The first piece is this top from Hollister. It says Wonder Woman on it, and I'm yet to see the Wonder Woman film. I really want to see the Wonder Woman film, like really, really badly, <laughs> because it's a new film out in cinemas. And this top was in the sale. I think it was about thirteen pounds, which is really good. And it says Wonder Woman on it, and it has the the Wonder Woman W on it, which is really nice. And it is a Raglan top, so it has the grey sleeves and then a lighter grey here and it is cropped you have to wear like high-waisted stuff otherwise oh, you can show your belly if you want but if you don't want to show your belly you're probably better off putting something that's high-waisted underneath it the next piece of clothing from Hollister is these shorts I love these sort of shorts I'm getting back into wearing them because I had a period of time where I bought loads of shorts wore them loads and then I kind of got into not wearing them at all and I want to get more into getting wearing stuff that's kind of out of my comfort zone so I I like skirts but I don't like wearing them myself because I feel very uncomfortable so I buy shorts that look like skirts so like this this looks kind of like a skirt um, but it's actually shorts and it is a woven it's called a woven short because it's like floaty and it has a beautiful floral pattern on it I want to say about 22 pounds this wasn't in the sale I actually never thought that I could fit into all this stuff because I thought it was more for like teens I mean I'm 20 I'm not a teenager anymore but like teenage bodies are more thinner so I thought I wouldn't be able to fit in it with my hips but obviously I can so that's good. So the other thing from Hollister is these shorts. I want to try and show you like what they are just plain ones, plain black with the white strip around the bottom and at the side and then there's the Hollister label here so you can tell it's from Hollister and I really like these, they're super super comfortable and those were about £11 I think, I want to say they're about £13 now because I swear they were £11 and they were £13 so I'm a bit confused, I think they're about £11. <laughs> the next item of clothing is this top from Jack Wheels and I've actually never bought anything from Jack Wheels before, this is the first piece of clothing that I've ever bought from there, actually no that's a lie, I got a hoodie, I got a hoodie like ages ago from, um, from Jack Wheels, that was a lie. Sozzy, they just lied to you. Bad, bad, Vicky. Jack Wheels were having a sale and this was £12 something, which is amazing because they're normally £19 or £20, roughly around that area. A candy pink colour with obviously the little um, pheasant in the corner. Some people call it a chicken, some people call it a peacock. It's actually a pheasant, but sometimes I like to call it a chicken just for laughs, just for the lols. I'm going to be using it for yoga because it's really, really soft, so that's actually the reason that I bought it. But I wanted a good quality t shirt and I could also wear it kind of casually anyway if I wanted to. Right, so next on to jewellery. So I make sure that I don't buy too much jewellery now because I wear a lot of jewellery. I wear jewellery that's quite cheap but is nice looking, do you know what I mean? So something that's, it looks nice but it's not expensive. I bought this bracelet from Topshop and I love it because it's got my star sign on it. I love star sign jewellery. It is my favourite. I also have a star sign necklace as well which I think I put in my one of my other hauls. This has my Scorpio sign on it and I can't really, I'm going to have to show you a close up, hang on. So this bracelet was half price, it was £7.50 which is absolutely ridiculous. I don't think I ever pay for a bracelet, £7.50 for this bracelet because it's so like thin. Because it was half price, I just have to get it. So half price it will be £3.75 if, if my math is correct. And I love it, I just love jewellery like this, like gold and black is one of my like favourite combinations. Another one I got is this gorgeous necklace also from Topshop and this was half price as well and this was also £7.50 so like the bracelet and the necklace are both £7.50 which is crazy but I got this for as I said £3.75 as I said if my math is correct and this says mermaid on it and it has a teeny tiny little star and I just think it's so pretty like it's just such a, a different necklace like I've never seen anything like this before the next thing is beauty so this is a lip scrub I got from Lush and it smells so freaking good I got the bubblegum one. I just realised I have no lipstick on today so I can just put this on my lips now. You're out on your lips. 
And then you lick it off. It's not cheap. <laughs> £5.75 and also it's vegan. Oh, it actually says vegan. Oh my gosh, I never, I never saw that. Yeah, so it's vegan. So if you are a vegan, you can use Lush product, which is really cool. They have five different flavours now, or smells, or whatever you want to call it, because you do taste the flavour. There was a honey one, a popcorn one, bubble gum, chocolate. The next thing is this nail art pen, and it is from ASOS. It's actually from a company called Wa Nails. Or WA, I don't really know what you call it. A WA London, W A H, and then London. They are a really popular nail salon, and I follow them on Instagram. They do the most sick nail art, and it's amazing. I saw this on their Instagram, I think it was, or someone was using it, and these are really, really good apparently. And I was trying to get my hands on one of these for ages. And they sell them on boots, but they don't actually sell them in the store anymore. They only sell them online and they didn't have a white or a black. And I'm like, girl, if you're going to have a nail up pen, at least have the basics. I uh, quickly looked on ASOS. I don't know why I was looking on there. I was looking on there for something else. And I saw they had a sale for some of the wire stuff. I was like, oh my God, yes. And they had this. And I was so happy because this was £9 down to £4.50 or £4. And they had the black one as well, but that was sold out. So I was so happy to get this. And what I love about this is it. A proper nail art pen so you have the obviously people who do nail art would know this anyway but um, you have the the long brush as you can see against my little cheek on my face I don't want to squirt it everywhere and then you have the little tiny little tiny tip at the end so you can do more intricate designs the last beauty item is this Cuccio high gloss top coat I was watching Kelly Marissa I was watching one of Kelly's videos and she does nail art on her channel and she's really really popular and she does the most amazing design so I'm just gonna link her down below I know this is not my nail art channel but if you want to see her designs they're really really good and her channel I'll link it down below she suggested using Cuccio's top coat and base coat and I really needed a new top coat because my ones were going really rank and they weren't doing so well so I bought this and I'm really really pleased it doesn't go well on more shiny polishes like holographic because it kind of mists over the holographic I'm not sure if this is for like normal or it's more for gel but she was using it just normally so I don't see why I can't use it like that but yeah so I bought this and this was from Amazon I think I got it for about five pounds and I think the base coat was about eight pounds which is really weird the last things are some flip flops so I got this one not just it's not just one I do have two here these two I have got some pink ones and I got white ones so these ones were from New Look and they were I still have the label on this I really should take it off $6.99 for both of these and I got these in the large and the large is slightly too big for me so I may have to just get like a standing knife and just cut around the flip flop so it fits me a bit better and I also caved and was a very very naughty girl because I don't need to save my monies but I tried these Havanas all right okay I don't know if I'm saying this right so you can correct me if I'm wrong it's Havanas or Havanas I'm Havanas I sound like I'm saying Havanas with an accent I'm Havanas so I got these white Havanas these are just some white flip flops they have like a pearly kind of bit on the hair so it isn't like proper matte white these were 25 pounds and I got them for 22 because I had a student discount which was really really good I actually never knew the Havana's did 10% discount which is amazing being a student makes you poor and not working if you don't work like I do and you're a student then you will be quite poor for a while and that's fine you just buy Havana's and make yourself feel better <laughs> so I really hope you enjoyed this haul uh, apologies if there isn't a lot here but I hope you enjoy the things that I did show you so if you like this video and you enjoyed watching it please get a big thumbs up and don't forget to comment down below and thank you for new subscribers hello if you are new please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and I will see you all in my next video thank you for watching bye I feel so far away when I do this yeah.